In your morning medical news, new research says black women have a higher risk of dying from breast cancer compared to white women, and racism is being partially blamed. Stephanie Stahl explains. It's been an uphill battle for Spring Williams, diagnosed with stage three breast cancer. Very scary, especially when you are healthy, uh, feeling healthy, looking healthy. The South Jersey mother of two was just 41. I went through chemotherapy, surgery, and radiation. That was a year after she found a lump that her first doctor said wasn't breast cancer. You were misdiagnosed. He was confident that it was a cyst. She believes racism may have delayed her diagnosis. New research says it's part of the reason why black women are more likely to die from breast cancer compared to white women. The study from Massachusetts General Hospital says there is a 17 to 50 percent disparity depending on the type of breast cancer. Black women with hormone positive tumors have the highest risk of death. Erica Warner led the study. Across all types of breast cancer, there's something that is driving um, this finding of consistent disparities between black and white women. The study says beyond tumor differences, the disparity is also caused by socioeconomic inequality, inadequate access, and systemic racism. The bias is pervasive at all levels. Breast surgeon Monique Gary, who runs a wellness farm, says the new research is the largest to date outlining disparities. We've got to do a better job of treating women the same. I'm a fighter. Spring, whose breast cancer battle isn't over yet, says discrimination detailed in the new research is an unfortunate reality for many. It makes me sad, but it also makes me hopeful that things will change. It's change that could save lives. The study analyzed more than 228,000 breast cancer cases from 2009 to 2022. It's published in the Journal of Clinical Oncology.